video you to this is the potita we need a pokemon battle weapon battle and my opponent is edgar or size destiny i will leave the link of his channel in the description go and check him out because great guy he gave me the guild wing salon fame ev train and everything and another couple of pokemon like um cute turtle time or fish anyway my team really quick is a mega absol max attack max speed and four in defense uh, has perfect IV in special defense. Then we have a Del Fox, Rest of Chestone with Magician, Cow Mind, and two moves offensive. Then we have a Choice Scarf Flycon, uh, I think Life of Lucario. Then I lost the Life of when I was changing items, I don't know where it went. Then a Rocky Helmet, Max Defense, Max HP Steelix, which unfortunately it doesn't have sturdy, it has Rogue. Rocket, and then we have my Reniculus, Palmine, Recover, Psychic, and Focus Blast. My opponent has good run. It could be Lefties or Assault Vests. I'm guessing Assault Vests because it's what you normally see. Although there are some impression ones, although not many lately. And then Gliscor. Oh, Gliscor. I hate you. Defensive, bit we have toxic, you know. Then we have a um, burn ninja, it could be life orb or choice car, yeah, protein, obviously. Then, uh, scalar drill. I thought scalar drill would be the rapid spinner. I don't know why, like, I forgot that Dolphin would carry a rapid spin. But, well, if it's not rapid spinner, it could be source stance, physically offensive. Then we have a uh, crobat. Black Sludge and Roost or Choice Bandit and lastly a John Fan Stealth Rocker that maybe is the, the Rapid Spinner, I don't know. Anyway, let's start the battle. So I decided to lead with my Absol to Mega Evolve because I thought he would lead with John Fan. But the thing was, will he predict my switch so I do not get hurt and go for Stealth Rock or just go for earthquake. I played it very very risky and I decided to stay in, make a ball and bounce these rocks and thankfully it worked because he forgot that Mega Absol Harris uh, has the ability Magic Bounce so he went for Stealth Rock so I bounced him back and I got rocks on his side of the field which is oh, so nice great beginning for the battle for me and <sighs> No fun. That was a crit and that did absolutely nothing. So right now I don't want to take a hit because Absol has a defense of a uh, white pepper bag. So I switched into Reniculus, the best thing I had to take a hit and earthquake. Uh, max defense and uh, max HP and he took it really well. And thankfully I gave it the leftovers before the battle before he had the life form. And um, it really 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 helped in this battle. You will see. So I was scared, uh, I was about to set up a Carmine, but I really wanted to do some damage to the down fan and in case he switched into the Lord Ninja, I went for Focus Blast, I missed, obviously. <laughs> and well, here it will be sped up a bit because it's a bit of a stolly part. So here it's just me trying to kill that annoying Gudra with Solvest. <sighs> The damage that I do is pathetic, you will see. I set up a common, don't play poison because it, it's better to be poisoned than paralyzed eventually, maybe if you got something that paralyzed me, although I don't think so. Anyway, Dark Plus is, eh, it does a bit of damage, and look at the Psyche, it does nothing, and I'm plus two, I think, plus one, I'm not sure. So, and I think here I made a mistake. I want yes here I wanted to recover. I went for calm and like shit, he will kill me next turn. Thankfully, because I gave it left towards I managed just to survive the dragon pulse with 29 HP, get the recover up, and he probably was cursing me. <laughs> he was <laughs> jelly didn't want to die. He was annoying him so here I am plus 3 maybe, I go for Psychic, I got a crit, and then it doesn't really matter because 
uh, I will win this battle. He just sped up a bit the thing, so I go again for recover, get some HP back, we left this, and finally, finally, destroy this annoying Gruda, Gruda, no Gudra, with a psychic, so his special world out of the way, which is excellent. So now he sends his Crobat. Uh, in a bit, <laughs> there we go. Here comes Crobat, and I'm like, okay, hey! can take a hit. I was about to see it, but I'm like, if he stays in, yeah, Psychic will kill it. Uh, no, he plays it safe, go for a U-turn, does a lot of damage, and I, for a moment I thought about going for Focus Blast, but no, I went for Psychic. So maybe if I went for Focus Blast and hit it, Scalarude will be dead, but anyway, doesn't matter. Psychic does a reasonable amount, being resisted at all. Look at that, almost half HP. And I thought about switching out here, but Ronicus did a lot, he deserved to rest, so I left it to die. Maybe, maybe he survived the hit, but well, that would have been really hilarious. No, he died. But oh well, anyway, I have a present into two with this scarf. Go for Earthquake, kill it, Scala Drill. He thought maybe I will over predict, go for your turn, I don't know. But nothing out of the way. I'm like, yes, now he can rabbit spin. Oh wait, he has the own fun. He can rabbit spin. Maybe I don't know. And here I'm expecting the eye shards. I don't want to take it because four time weeks. Yes, he will do a lot of damage or kill me. So I go into my Steelix, physically defensive. <laughs> the damage it does is absolutely nothing. 10 HP. So well. That's fine. Here, I wanted to see how much Earthquake would do. He goes for knockoff, which is fine by me. Get some damage with the Rocky Helmet before he knocks it out. And Earthquake, look at that damage. Horrible. It's pathetic. I think it does less than leftovers or the same amount. <laughs> I don't know. But around there. So it's terrible. And here, expecting the Earthquake, I'm going to shoot. But he actually makes it really well, he go for stealth room and like shit. No, I wasn't about to switch up soul to a possible earthquake. And here, maybe he will over predict and me switching out and don't go for ice shard, but no, he played smart, go for ice shard. I survived. Wow. <laughs> really amazing that too. I think I have 4 in defense or in HP, I'm not sure. But anyway, I go for the U turn and get a free switch into Foxy so now I can throw him out with a special attack and for a moment here I thought about going for the Cow Mind but I really wanted to do some damage to that thing because it was an annoyance so I went straight for the flamethrower just to maybe kill it but he switched into Gliscor which is fine and uh, he doesn't take it really well at all it does a decent amount of damage, more than half. And here, just in case he wouldn't protect, I didn't want to take an earthquake, so I'm going to Absol. Although, that was dumb. Maybe I did expect the protect to get some HP back. Probably. Um, here, I do another risky play. Go for the sword stance. Again, expecting the protect. Because he was really damaged, so every bit of HP is good. So I get a free sword stance, which is great. And go for Psycho Cat this turn. This is too slow. There we go. I go for Psycho Cat. But still, look at that. He take it Oof, really well. And he either forgot that I had multi pounds or he predicted my switch. I'm not sure. And here I go for Sucker Punch because it being stuff, it does more damage than Psycho Cat. And he had to attack me because, well, magic bounce. He can do anything inside attack me. And here comes Crobat. For a moment, I wasn't sure if he will roost or not. Just in case, I went for Sucker Punch because I haven't seen an item yet. So I wasn't sure if it was Black Sludge or Choice Bandit. But just in case, Sucker Punch. And it worked out because I take it out. And here comes Girl Ninja. I go for a quick attack. Uh, I. I forgot that stab made uh, more damage with Sucker Punch, or I don't know. 
but I managed to survive this call. I was like, goodbye, Absol, but nope, he took it. Everything is surviving in this game with a little bit of HP, don't that's me how. Maybe that four defense, no, the max uh, IVs, IVs, IVs. In special defense, managed to make Absol survive, I'm not sure. Anyway, and uh, here I go for Sucker Punch because he has to attack me and it does more damage than quick attack so yeah i outspeed the ice chart and managed to take stone fun that was one of my bits of the existence and here comes clear ninja again he does pokemon and without another quick attack i managed to take it out again i don't know why quick attack and not soccer punch maybe if he was if he had some move that um, i don't know uh, no damaging move, not sure. And water shuriken, yeah, I don't think he had it because I'm not sure who would outspeed if he went for water shuriken. Hmm, questions, I'm not sure. I have to see the speed of both to see. And well, I had another battle with this guy, so that will probably be tomorrow, so wait for it. And again, thanks for those Pokemon and the battle. Check them out. The link is in the description. And well, I hope you enjoy. I see you next time. Bye bye.